Good morning, uh, I'm Brad from Blue Horse Products and um, today I'm going to be following through on an experiment that I talked about in my last blog uh, post which was why does coffee go stale and is there anything that we can do to prevent coffee from going stale. It seems like a general consensus on the reason why coffee goes stale is that um, oxygen oxidizes the coffee and um, over time um, a few weeks that's what causes the roasted whole beans to go stale. So we all know that if you compare the first scoop of a fresh really roasted bag of coffee to the last scoop um, there's a big difference. There's a noticeable difference in the flavor, there's a very noticeable difference in the bloom if you're using a Chemex or a, some other type of pour over. Um, what I explained in the last post was I was going to buy some four ounce jars, some airtight glass jars, some oxygen absorbers, um, buy some fresh coffee. Um, I also have my Chemex here and basically the plan is I'm going to take this bag of coffee which is 12 ounces. These are four ounce jars so I could fit this into three jars but I'm going to split it over four jars. I'm going to put oxygen absorbers in three of the jars so we'll have a control jar with just coffee and then we'll have three jars with oxygen absorbers. So I'm going to spread this test out over four weeks and compare the freshness of the jars as we go along to see if there's um, any noticeable difference between um, the jars with the oxygen absorbers and the jar with that one. Um, Alright, so I guess let's get started. I'm going to heat up some water and I'm going to grind some of this coffee. We will um, look at the bloom as it's poured so we have something to compare to um, in our next test and uh, I'm excited to see what happens. So I'm using a Barazza Virtuoso grinder here and I'm using a grind setting of 20. Alright, let's see what happens. This is uh, day three for these grinds. They were roasted about three days ago. We can see we're getting a very nice bloom there, as I would expect from some good fresh coffee. Okay, while that finishes, let's um, continue with the experiment that we're going to um, be following through with for the next few weeks. So basically I'm just going to take what's left of this coffee, which is still obviously very fresh, uh, less than three days old, and I'm going to split it up into four jars. And we have these oxygen absorbers that I got on Amazon for very inexpensive. Um, I think it was like 10 bucks for 50 of them. All right, so there's our four jars, and I will see you in a week when we will compare this jar to this jar. All right, I'll see you next week.